Bosch Measuring Tools is the worldwide leader in laser measuring and leveling technology, increasing productivity on the job site every day. This is the Bosch GMS120 wall scanner that is used for interior detection of wood, metal, and electrical wires in floors and walls. The GMS120 is a single tool that can detect and locate wood studs, metal objects, and electrical wiring in any wall or floor at up to four and three quarters inch deep, depending on wall material type. To ensure worry-free accuracy, the GMS120 self-calibrates once the tool begins detection and continuously self-calibrates during detection. The GMS120 provides easy to view and understandable information. The large illumination ring changes color to green for no object found, orange for object near, red for object found within sensor range. The tool pinpoints the center of the object and has a convenient marking hole for leaving reference marks. The easy to view LED screen shows more detailed information such as mode of operation, strength of signal, and type of material found. The GMS120 comes with a belt pouch and battery. Experience the productivity of the GMS120 wall scanner on your project. Welcome to Zircon headquarters here in California. Today, let's talk about the Zircon Multi-Scanner I-521 Step, a multifunction stud finder with center vision technology that finds the edges and center of studs in one step. Zircon scanners require adequate voltage to power the LCD screen and the sensing technology inside the tool. Like most of your electronic devices, the multi-scanner I-520 requires a fully charged battery to function accurately. So before scanning, you'll need to install a new 9-volt alkaline battery with an extended expiration date. To locate the edges and center of wood or metal studs through a typical wall, which is one layer of drywall up to 3 quarters of an inch deep, use stud scan mode. Switch to deep scan mode to scan through thicker walls up to one and a half inches deep. Push and hold the power button. Wait for calibration to complete. The word stud on the screen indicates that the calibration is complete. And now we'll slowly slide the tool across the wall. There's one edge. I'm going to go ahead and mark that edge. Center. Mark the center. And then mark the next edge. Now notice that we have three signal strength bars. And the signal strength bars are important because if all of your studs are indicating three signal strength bars, and then you come across an object with a weaker signal, that tells you it's probably not a stud. So it helps you differentiate between studs and other objects like plumbing that could be behind your wall as well. Now if you don't find anything when you scan in stud scan mode, then switch to deep scan mode for thicker walls. And when you're scanning in deep scan mode, you'll probably only get one signal strength bar. The I-520 also has auto-correcting technology, so if you happen to start directly over a stud and then move away, the tool will automatically recalibrate and point an arrow back to the stud. Wire warning detection lets me know there are live, unshielded wires when scanning. Now after you've used stud scan mode to locate the edges in the center of your stud, it's a really good idea to switch into metal scan mode and run vertically up and down the stud. Now if it's a wood stud, we're going to find the drywall screws, and that way we know it's a wood stud. Now with a, a metal stud, again, you're going to use, use stud scan mode to find the edges and the center. Then when you switch into metal scan mode, you're going to get a really solid reading all the way up and down, and that way we know we, uh, we found a, a metal stud. If you have some conduit back in the wall, that would also give you a solid reading so make sure that your uh, metal studs, make sure you have the proper 16-inch spacing that you would expect. The Zircon Multi-Scanner i520 also has its own dedicated AC scan mode. In this mode, the LCD display screen indicates when the tool is moving closer to or away from the source of the voltage. This will help you identify where live wires track through the walls. With all of these features, the i520 will help you conquer even your most difficult projects with the professional confidence that comes from owning a Zircon. Welcome to Zircon headquarters in California. Today, let's talk about the Zircon Stud Sensor E50, a stud finder that quickly and easily locates the edges of wood and metal studs 
and joists behind walls, floors, and ceilings. Zircon scanners require adequate voltage to power the integrated technology and display screen. Just like most of your electronic devices, the Stud Sensor E50 requires a fully charged battery to function accurately. So before scanning, you'll need to install a new 9-volt alkaline battery with an extended expiration date. The Stud Sensor E50 features two scanning modes. Stud Scan mode locates the edges of wood or metal studs through one layer of drywall up to three quarters of an inch deep. Use Deep Scan mode to scan through thicker walls up to one and a half inches deep. Some people wonder if they should use Stud Scan mode or Deep Scan mode. Always use Stud Scan mode first. Stud Scan is used for normal walls that have one, one layer. You only need deep scan mode on thicker walls like a firewall with two layers. If you use deep scan mode and you don't need it, the unit could indicate other objects behind the wall that are not studs. So start in stud scan mode and if you don't find anything, then switch to deep scan mode. The patented pivot pinch grip design allows you to hold the tool comfortably in either hand at any angle. To find a stud, place your stud sensor E50 against the wall, press and hold the button. The word ready on the screen indicates the tool is calibrated and ready to scan. Slowly slide the tool across the wall. The display, spotlight, and audio tone indicate one edge of the stud. Mark that edge. Now we don't want to put a screw there because that's only one edge of the stud. We need to continue scanning past the stud while holding the button in reverse directions and mark the other edge. The center of the stud is halfway between the two marks. If you happen to start scanning over a stud and move away, the tool's display will flash and the unit will beep to indicate a calibration error. Simply move the tool a few inches away to either side and turn it on again. The stud sensor E50 also has an important feature called wire warning detection that alerts you to the presence of a potentially live AC wire in the vicinity of your scan up to two inches deep. This feature is active in all modes. With these features, the E50 will help you conquer even your most difficult projects with the professional confidence that comes from owning a Zircon. If you're interested in buying one of these products, links to all the products mentioned in this video are in the description down below. If you like and found this video helpful, don't forget to give a like, comment and subscribe. Thank you for watching.